Hi, my name is Father Dan Cambra. I invite you to join me each day during Lent to meditate upon the Passion of Christ as reflected in the diary of St. Maria Faustina Kowalska, the Secretary of Divine Mercy, and to make a spiritual communion. For the next four days, we will contemplate the scourging at the pillar. For me, paragraph 445 is one of the most difficult ones in the whole diary of St. Faustina to read. If you have a copy of the diary and wish to read it in its entirety, please remember I warned you, it isn't pretty. When I came for adoration, and recollection took hold of me immediately, I saw the Lord Jesus tied to a pillar, stripped of his clothes, and the scourging began immediately. I saw a man who took turns at striking the Lord with scourges. My heart almost stopped at the sight of these tortures. Jesus said to me, I suffer even greater pain than you see. Jesus gave me to know for what sense he was subjecting himself to these scourgings. These are the sins of impurity. Please join me in praying the spiritual communion composed by St. Alphonsus Liguri, the founder of the Redemptorist communities. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the Blessed Sacrament. I love you above all things and I desire you in my soul. Since I cannot now receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. As though you are already there, I embrace you and unite myself completely to you. Do not permit that I should ever be separated from you. Amen. As Jesus has come into your heart now, confidently ask him for all your needs and to bless those people you lift up in prayer. The Lord be with you. And through the intercession of the Blessed Virgin Mary, who was immaculately conceived, Saint Joseph, her chaste spouse, and Saint Faustina, the Secretary of Divine Mercy, may God Almighty bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.